that just got delivered to my home today. <laughs> I couldn't even wait until I carried it to go ahead and push out this video. So this is the Art Mini, and it is a part of the Keith Herring collection that is currently on Kipling.com. However, the collection is quite old now, so a lot of the selections have sold out. I got my hand on this beauty by doing a simple Google search. I found a website and the name of it will also be in the description box below, but it's called ukes.com and I had never heard of it. So I even had to go on and kind of like do a little check to make sure everything was legit. And it was, I ordered this bag and it came a week later, despite the website saying that there was a 12 to 15 day um, shipping period. So I was very happy when I got it today. Let's get right into this bag. This bag is called the Art Mini by Kipling. And I want to send a shout out to JK's World because I have been stalking her videos. Hey girl, if you're watching, she had a Kipling video some years ago that she posted with, um, I want to say the Art Small, and it was in black. And I fell in love with that video. And so I was so happy to find this particular style. Um, I will tell you why. <laughs> this particular style, like I said, is a part of the Keith Herring collection. And oh my, let's take a look at everything, you all. I got to take the tags off. I was just so excited. So this is a part of the Keith Herring collection. And if you watch me modeling the bag, um, at the beginning part of the video, then you saw how excited I was to discover that you could carry it crossbody. I could carry it as a shoulder bag. It's just the ultimate. And it's mini. <laughs> you all know I love these mini bags. So what I thought I would do, which will be fun, is you guys know I just did a video on my Coca-Cola bag. And so I thought I would take the items out of my Coca-Cola bag and transport them into my brand new Art Mini, okay? So let's do that, okay? So let me go ahead and show you some of the wonderful features of this bag. So take a look. I'm going to go ahead and try to show it now. Look at the handle. So the handles have this little faux leather part on top that actually say Kipling. I love that. I absolutely love that. There is a Kipling logo. It is the, the rubberized logo, so I like that. Then you also have, y'all can't ignore this heart here. This is why I wanted the bag. If you look on the website, um, the Keith Herring Collection on Kipling.com, Keith Haring is an artist that was popular in the 80s and he did a lot of like art, like subway art. And so I really like this heart. He has some other things that mm, were not necessarily my favorite, but I loved. For example, that Delia Compact, he has, I think like a barking wolf man on that. If there was a heart on that, I probably would have gotten that, but there's a heart on this one. And so this is why I wanted this one because this is like sums up how I feel, right? I just love spreading love. The bag itself, can you believe it? It is actually in the traditional nylon. So you know I'm excited because you can wipe this clean. And that's important by it being a white bag. You can also see all of Keith Heron's artwork and gray 
all around the background of the bag. I love how they have like these blue handle straps. Isn't it just gorgeous, you guys? I gotta cut these tags off. I get so excited. Then there's like these faux leather pieces on the back here and then also on the front here. Now, here is the wonderful thing I love about this bag. Now, there are pockets galore. So first you have this zip pocket, which is right here with a traditional Kipling zipper with a little paper clip. I love that. And then you have a slip pocket. So I was thinking I could put my phone in that slip pocket. Isn't that perfect? Then when I go ahead to enter the bag, first of all, let me show you. This is like a little convertible bag. I can take this little snap here and snap it. Okay, let me go ahead and take off the, the what is this called? The shoulder strap. So I'm, taking, I'm removing the shoulder strap because I want to show you how you can turn this bag into a different silhouette, okay? So I'm going to go ahead and snap these pieces in right here. Okay, let me snap it in on the other side. There's where the little hook is for the shoulder bag. I hope I'm showing this correctly. And then I'm going to like push in the sides. And when I push it in, I can zip up the bag. Isn't that cool? And so it gives it like a little different shape. Oh, look at that. Isn't that divine? So I could turn the bag into something cute like this if I wanted to. I just love the ability to be able to transform this bag. Now I'm gonna put it back the other way because I I really love the way <laughs> that it looks with the little pieces sticking out like this. I like that and the little zipper exposed. I really like that. So I'm gonna keep that for right now, but it's nice to know that I could change it up if I want to. Let me put the um, handles back on, the little shoulder strap back on as well, because that's one of my favorite features to be able to switch back and forth between the shoulder strap and the little um, arm handles here. I love that, love that, love that. And the blue color, don't even get me started. Did you see the blue pants that I wore? <laughs> that I wore in the little demo just to try to match this blue, but you don't have to match this blue. This bag makes a statement and I love the statement that it makes. I even love the little monkey. Look at that. Looks like artwork, doesn't it? So let's get started before this video gets way too long. I'm going to take the things out of my Coca-Cola bag that you all saw in my last video, which I love this bag, still going to carry it. I'm going to take some things out and I'm going to put them, let me just take everything out that I have. I'm going to take everything out of my Coca-Cola bag and then I'm going to go ahead and proceed to put them inside of my Keith Haring Art Mini. I'm too excited, you all. You have to excuse me because this is why I wait a couple of days <laughs> before I do a video because I get so excited when these uh, packages arrive. <laughs> Okay, so anyway, let's go ahead and get into it. So I want to see about putting maybe my wallet in this front zipper part. Let's see how that would look. Here's my wallet. Oh, nice. I could put it there. Let's see. Yep, that's cute. I put my wallet in the front zipper part. I plan on putting my phone in this part. I'm actually filming with it now. I usually take the case off, but y'all. Like I said, I was ecstatic to be able to film this video. So here goes the smooth zipper in the front. So this is why I like to leave this part exposed because it can help me hold the bag while I pull this very smooth zipper. Oh, very nice. Now let's start looking in the bag. I have a zip pocket in the bag because Keith Haring and Kipling. And then look what is on this wall. And it's fully lined. J. Carrick's World, if you're watching, I know your bag wasn't lined, but this one is fully lined. So there's a slip pocket here for your phone. So I could put my phone in here. There's another slip pocket, like a little pocket sticking out. And there's an ink pen pocket. I love this. And did I mention it's fully lined? <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and put in my creativity and small you guys have seen the contents of this in a couple of other videos so i'm just going to stick this in oh nice then i'm going to go ahead and stick in my target reusable bag and stick that right in okay i'm going to stick my tissues let's see i'm going to put it in one of these pockets how about right here in the slip pocket my tissues then I'm going to take my cute little Ikea bag. Again, you all, these Ikea bags are on sale now at Ikea for 50 cents. If I were you, I would run, not walk, and grab these. They are really, really cute. 
you can you should probably pick up a few of them right so you can have them so that bag goes in there and then i have my sunnies but i don't want to just throw them in here since this is a larger bag i have my Privé revoke case i'm just going to put that in there i love what it says you are every shade of awesome i'm going to go ahead and just put that inside see there okay oh i'm loving this and then i can take my little lemon case and put that inside as well and my pen because i wouldn't dare put a pen in this pen slot i would be too afraid with this white bag that it's going to go ahead and bust and since there is no key leash i'm going to go ahead and take my keys and i think i'm going to stick them in the little pocket here put them in like this see and then leave this part sticking out so i can grab them easily hmm do i like that We'll see for now. <laughs> now I'm going to zip everything up. Oh my goodness, y'all. You cannot tell me this is the cutest thing ever. Oh, I just love it. So everything, of course, can fit in it because it's obviously a little bit bigger than the little mini backpacks that I've been carrying. But y'all, I'm excited. So if you want to get your hands on this bag, I would hurry because the only place that I found this particular style was on ukes.com. Okay. And so I want to be able to share videos with you and have you all be able to grab the styles of the bags that I'm showing if you choose to. Okay. <laughs> so this is my video. I'm loving this. You all tell me what you think of this cute little pan bag. Oh, it's just adorable. Again, it is made from the crinkle nylon. So even though it is white, if you've ever touched a Kipling bag, you know that you can wipe it clean. I wouldn't dare put this though in the washing machine just because I think that tears away at bags over time. I would just wipe clean as you need to. Here is the bottom. The bottom is also, oh, of course, that nylon. It's got the beautiful print on the bottom as well. So I'm pleased with my purchase, you all. I cannot wait to go somewhere and carry it. I got to get these tags off. I love everything about this bag. And I hope that I didn't repeat myself too many times. I'm just so excited about this. Thank you all so much for watching. Grace and peace. Bye.